Let's talk about your fear of sea urchins. Uh, don't even sea urchins. No, come on. I can't. You're actually serious about this. I'm. Do you know what a sea urchin is? Do you know what they are? You, if they're, you knew what sea urchins were, you would be terrified. Well, listen. <laughs> they're just these. They, they're in the. They're on rocks and they're spiny looking. There. And the poor things are just minding their own business. No, they're not. They're not. That's the thing. They're just. They're like. They're like a grenade. They're like. They're. They're sitting there waiting to completely injure you to the point where. Okay, so you step, you can't see a sea urchin if you're, okay, like if you're in the Caribbean, you're like, this water is so beautiful, it's amazing, and you're walking, it's clear water, you can't see a sea urchin's right there, and then you step on one, and then it has barbs, and it goes into whatever it touches, and then you have to go to the emergency room, and it has to be surgically removed. You could lose your foot, you could lose your hand, you could lose your hand trying to get it off of your foot. <laughs> I don't like sea, sea urchins. Listen, <laughs> let, me, let me tell you something about sea urchins. They can puncture and injure you and cause swelling and redness. Does that sound like stuff that you want? That's, but, <laughs> but that's not what you just, you just described losing your hand and your foot. You could lose your hand no, you... and your foot from swelling and redness. It's a, it's a living thing that would be stuck in you like it's a knife. Not, it's not living and it's the spine. And, and a lot of people, that you're not, it's not going to happen to you, number one. I do, yeah, because I don't want to go near clear water. Yeah. <laughs> Just murky water? OK, yes. let's, let's talk about another irrational fear of yours. You, you're scared of getting arrested. I'm, I'm scared of getting framed. <laughs> so. OK, now you've gone one step beyond. Uh, uh, wh who would frame you and for what? You, oh, so many people would frame me. And, um, and, and they could frame you for any, any crime that you could go to, to jail for. And I, you know, look at me, I wouldn't survive in jail. <laughs> and and I, I think it comes from the fact that like, I could open up my phone, I could look at my phone and, and see any headline written about me at any time. And it could be like the most ridiculously untrue thing. And so it, I think the dream and the nightmare of being framed comes from like, I could, I could do nothing wrong. I could sit in my house with the cats all day, and somehow there could be an article about like me buying a house I've never in a place I've never been or dating a guy I've never met. Right. So it's like, you know. But then you take it a step further, oh, and no. in a nightmare world, it's being framed for murder. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't think that's a step. That's a leap. That's a. That's. But anyway, you, I think you're fine, and I think you'd even have fans in prison, and they would take care of you, and they would all <laughs> love you, and you would. Thanks, that's All nice. Right.